Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel ECEZ Tutorials. So friends, in today's video, I will be discussing three important as well as a very easy shortcuts uh, from the chapter integration. So this is going to be the part two of integration. Uh, if you haven't watched part one video of integration shortcuts, the link will be given in the description box. So you can please check out. So friends, without further ado, let's get started. So friends, here is our first question. So the question is integration of e power x into sin x plus cos x dx. So if you try to solve this question without using any shortcut, it will really take a lot of time. You will multiply e power x with the terms inside uh, the brackets and then you'll split it and then you apply the uv method it will take a lot of time but in exam you will not have this much of time because you have max physics chemistry and also the core subjects so in that case you can make use of the shortcut that i'm going to be discussing right now so let's see what is the shortcut that you can use to solve these kind of so friends here is our shortcut so the shortcut is if the given question okay if the given question is in the form of integration of e power x into f of x plus f dash of x which means d by dx of f of x into dx then the answer is e power x into f of x plus c where c is a constant okay so first you have to check whether the given question is in the form of this one. So let's first check if the given question is in the form of the shortcut that I have written here. So first e power x. So first integration. Next e power x is as it is into sin x. So f of x is sin x. So let me write it here. f of x is sin x. Okay. Next f dash of x. So what is f dash of x? f dash of x is nothing but d by dx of f of x right so what is f of x we know that f of x is sin x so d by dx of in place of f of x i'm writing sin x so what is the differentiation of sin x the differentiation of sin x is cos x so we got f of x as sin x and f dash of x is equals to cos x so e power x is as it is and then f of x is what we got f of x we got f of x as sin x so if f of x is sin x plus f dash of x f dash of x is cos x into dx right so the given question is in the form of this one. So if we substitute f of x and f dash of x, so we got this, uh, this term is equal to the same question, right? E of x, I mean e power x is same sin x plus cos x. So this shortcut is applicable for this question, right? So the answer is going to be e power x into f of x. So we, we are going to write e power x as it is. And what is f of x? f of x is sin x. So sin x plus c. So this is the answer. So friends, by make using of these kind of shortcuts, you can solve these problems in this easy way. You can solve it within seconds. So one thing you have to remember is the question must be in the form of e power x into f of x and the differentiation of f of x. So differentiation of sin x is cos x. If the question is in the form of e power x into f of x plus f dash of x, one thing you have to remember is the answer is e power x into f of x. If you do not make use of this shortcut and if you try to solve it using a normal multiplication and then splitting the integration and then applying the uv method, it becomes uh, really long. So remember this shortcut it will be really helpful for you in the exam so friends here is our second question so now let's see if we can solve this problem 
uh, using the shortcut that we have just discussed okay so the question is integration of e power x divided by x into 1 plus x log x dx so just now i have told you that if the question is in the form of e power x into f of x plus f dash of x dx then only you can use this uh, shortcut okay so if the question is in the form of uh, this format then only you can use this shortcut otherwise you cannot so uh, if you take a look into the question the given question is not in the form of this one right so here we have e power x by x but here we have only e power x and uh, f of x uh, let's take it as 1 differentiation of 1 is not x log x so you might think you cannot apply this shortcut for this question right but you can solve this question using this shortcut let me show you how so first multiply this denominator x uh, inside this bracket multiply with both the terms so what you will get e power x into 1 divided by x plus multiply x with x uh, x log x what you will get x log x divided by x dx okay now uh, cancel this x and this x so after cancelling what will you get you will get e power x into 1 by x plus log x dx okay now let's see if this shortcut is in the form of this one so e power x e power x satisfied next let's take uh, let's take f of x as log x okay I am taking f of x as log x. So, what is the differentiation of uh, f of x, f dash of x, which is d by dx of f of x. So, what is d by dx of log x? We know that the differentiation of log x is 1 by x. Okay. So, f of x is uh, log x and f dash of x is 1 by x. This is f of x and this is f dash of x and we also have into e power x so this one is in the form of this shortcut so we can apply this shortcut to solve this problem so what is the answer now it's just e power x into f of x what is f of x f of x is log x plus c is the final answer so we have just multiplied this 1 by x inside and we have checked whether it is uh, in the form of e power x into f of x plus f dash of x dx so if it is then you can uh, then you will get the final answer as e power x into f of x so we have proved that uh, the given question is in the form of e power x into f dash of x plus f of x and hence we got the answer as e power x into f of x which is e power x into log x plus c so this is our final answer so friends now let's move on to the second short so friends here is our uh, first question in the second shortcut so the question is integration of sin x plus x cos x dx so how you will solve this uh, problem using shortcut is uh, what we are going to discuss so first let's see what is the shortcut that we are going to use the, uh, to solve this problem so friends here is the shortcut that we are going to use so uh, the shortcut is integration of f of x plus x into f dash of x dx is equals to x into f of x plus c so quite similar to the previous shortcut so you have to just check whether the question is in the form of this shortcut and if it is uh, uh, same then you can uh, get the final answer in this format so let's first check if the question uh, if we can use the shortcut to solve this problem so first let's take f of x as sin x so f of x is equals to sin x so what is f dash of x we have f of x and f dash of x i am taking f of x as sin x i am taking this one as f of x and what is the uh, f dash of x f dash of x is d by dx of f of x right so d by dx of what is f of x f of x is sin x so d by dx of sin x is 
cos x differentiation of sin x is cos x right so we got f f of x and f dash of x so now let's compare what we have in place of f of x we have sin x right f of x is sin x so i'm writing f of x as sin x and what is f dash of x f dash of x is cos x f dash of x is cos x so i'm writing cos x i'm going to keep this x as it is now if you replace uh, f of x with sin x and f dash of x with cos x what you will get you will get sin x plus x into x is as it is what is f dash of x f dash of x is cos x into dx right now let's see so let's compare this one with the question sin x is sin x as it is plus plus x into cos x here also we have x into cos x dx dx so what is the final answer just x into f of x plus c is are the final answer so x is as it is what is f of x f of x is sin x plus c that's it this is at the uh, final answer so uh, you can see uh, using these uh, shortcuts how we can solve this problem very easily in just few seconds uh, so friends here is our third shortcut so this is the question given so the question given is integration of e power 2x into 2 sin x plus cos x dx so if these kind of uh, questions are given then you can solve these kind of questions using this shortcut so if the given question is in the form of integration of e power ax into a into f of x plus f dash of x dx then the final answer you can directly write as e power ax into f of x plus c so let's see if uh, you can solve this uh, uh, problem using this shortcut so first let's compare this uh, question with this shortcut so if you compare e power 2x and e power ax so what is the value of uh, a compare e power 2x and e power ax so what is the value of a the value of a is 2 right the value of a is 2 so i'm going to write it as substitute 2 in place of a so what you will get e power 2x into 2 into f of x is sin x so i'm writing directly and what is f dash of x d by dx of f of x f of x is sin x so d by dx of sin x is cos x so f dash of x becomes cos x dx now compare this one with the question that is given here so we have e power 2x we have 2 sin x we have 2 sin x here plus cos x and also we have here plus cos x dx so what is the final answer going to be so the final answer is going to be e power 2x into f of x what we have taken f of x we have taken f of x as sin x right so f of x becomes sin x plus c so this is our final answer so friends uh, now let's move on to the second problem of the same model so friends here is our last problem uh, so let's solve this problem using the third shortcut that we have discussed so first let's compare the shortcut sorry let's compare this uh, question with the shortcut sorry this is a and f of x right this is the shortcut so if you compare uh, this term e power ax with this question what will you get the value of a the value of a will be 3 right so we have got the value of a as 3 now uh, let's take f of x as tan x okay uh, so f of x is tan x and what is the differentiation of tan x d by dx of f of x which is tan x so differentiation of tan x is secant square x right so substitute f of x f dash of x and a values in this uh, shortcut so we get e power 3x into a is 3 3 into tan x plus secant square x right into dx so this question and this one here matches so what is the answer you will get simple e power x into f of x is tan x so e power x into tan x plus c is the final answer 
so friends these are the three important shortcuts from the chapter integration so if you like this video please do not forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and also if you have any suggestions uh, or any complaints uh, please let me know in the comment section i'm ready to accept so yeah that's it for the video thank you for watching